Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be fixing and cleaning up Dawn of the Dance Cleo. So I got her a few days ago second hand on eBay and she finally came today and I kind of just want to get to washing her because I'm someone who I don't care what the condition of the doll is when she comes. I'm cleaning her up like it just you do not know where she's been. Clean her, you know. So there's not much wrong with her. Like her hair is not it could be definitely worse, like, you know, I can do this, which is saying something. As I know some people like have done that's Cleo and it's like rock hard with the glue. Mine is pretty hard, but it's more the scalp, so I may try to do the Gooby Gone treatment. Hopefully that works. And she actually has elastics, so she's not a re-release. She's got white elastics, if you can see that. I don't know much about elastics. I only know gold elastics usually like means um, like that's the first wave. So this is my first time actually having a doll with elastics. They are pretty tight, so I'm really happy about that. Because <laughs> I'm not really in the mood to try fix elastics at all. So yeah, and another ish well, issue I had was this shoe kept falling off like constantly. Um, it was a really simple solution. I just like put a bit of like blue tack in her shoe and now that's work. I'll show. I've just done that. Some blue tack in her shoe and that's kind of stopped it from falling off constantly. So yes and kind of off note, I'm hoping this year to try get more Dawn of, the, Dawn of the Dance dolls. I'm hoping for Claudine, Gulia mainly because I've already got Frankie and now I've got Cleo. She's a little wonky. You'll probably be able to see it more when I wash her and the camera isn't fun, <laughs> but uh, but you know what, let's just get right to washing her. So let's go. Okay, so here I am in my bathroom now and here's Cleo. I took all of her accessories off and I also took her arms off because they're just annoying. <laughs> so I'm ready to just start using the Goopy Gun. So I'm going to use that first and then just kind of take it from there. And while I do it, I'll probably wash her body because, like I said, you don't know where this doll's been, so we're gonna give her a full wash and let me just sit her there. And I am gonna be wearing gloves for this because my hands are like kind of sensitive, they've been getting a little dry, I'm not sure if you can see that, so I don't want them getting any worse. And since this is another doll I'm washing, I don't want my hair, not my hair, my hands getting more dry, so I'm just gonna put these gloves on real quick so I don't like make my hands worse than what they already are right now and let me get the gooby gone so now all i'm gonna do is just rub and massage in the gooby gone and cleo's hair and that is basically what i'm doing in the rest of this like part of the video so just enjoy the music and see we wash it out i guess <laughs> just finished up putting the goo be gone in her hair so now I'm just gonna set a timer for one hour and 30 minutes because I, I did watch a video for this I'll link the video down below if you want to check it out because this isn't really a tutorial by the way just want to say right now you could try using this one but I recommend the other video that I watch the video that I watched to do this but basically you saw what I done there and I, I got like so much on her legs they look so shiny so yeah i'm really impatient so i'm probably just gonna do some stuff while i wait honestly it's really sad <laughs> the way i've sat her in my bathtub she looks so sad but that's what you get for having a little hair cleo anyway so i'll see you guys in like a bit <laughs> so now that's been one like just over half an hour and a half i'm just gonna start rinsing the goopy gum out since like it doesn't smell awful but i don't really want it her hair smelling like it so I've got some like, what do you call it, dish soap and I'm just going to wash it all out. But, and also, please ignore, I cannot find any other doll brushes. So we're going to have to use these um, brass ones, so please ignore how weird that is. And we're just going to start washing it all out. <laughs>
washed it all out. Her hair is smelling less like goo gone, I think. Um, yeah, no, I can't smell as much. And I think if it comes to it, I'll even spray some perfume in her that I maybe don't use. So yes, we're just gonna have to wait a few hours and I'll check back in on Cleo and see how her hair's turned out. And obviously show you guys the final result. Okay, so are you guys ready to see the final result? Here she is. Okay, that was like so awkward. <laughs> Here she is. Okay, so I finally put her back in her outfit. And oh my gosh, her hair, like, it's not really like a big transformation, it's just kind of like, um, if you came and touched her transformation, but it just is so much more flowy. Oh my god. And I'm so happy that she turned out. Oh my goodness. A little like moment here. So I, I never actually said what I'm missing from her because I didn't get her complete. Um, she is missing one of her earrings. She only has one. She also is missing her eye coffin. The photo that's like, the photo that's got like Cleo, Deuce and Gulia like this. I don't have that and her little bag so i need to try to keep a lookout for that but she's mostly complete i kind of like kind of the main stuff you know and i am kind of tempted to try to give her like g3 fleo's phone but like obviously in the other hand but i don't know <laughs> but no she came out so cute and I actually had a lot of fun doing this, so I might do another video like this when I get a new doll, of course, like that has like low seepage. But oh my god, I really love her, I don't know. See, like, I'm someone who really likes doing doll hair and that, and this was like so much fun to do. <laughs> like, getting all the glow seepage out and like, scrubbing it, that was so fun. And I also like started like picking out some strands that were like hanging off, like at the ends. So her ends look like really nice. There's no like little bits hanging off. She just looks really perfect. Cause I was like, I was kind of being a perfectionist when I came to her there. And now I have Frankie and Cleo together. Why is Frankie looking so much taller? Oh, the stand's thicker. <laughs> I was like, why is Frankie so much taller right now? But no, oh my gosh. I, like she looks so cute. She looks like so cute. And they've got like Cleo who's like, get out of my face because she's like the not the re-release unlike frankie but oh my god no they look so cute together this is such a moment to be honest <laughs> anyway um i hope you guys enjoyed watching and i will try to do a video later wait no oh my god i'll be back there's glow seepage maybe i'll do one of her if i can be bothered but like not really want to take it the factory style right now but anyway thank you so much for watching and don't forget to like or subscribe and stuff if you like this because i will definitely be doing more of these videos because this is so much fun like i said but anyway thank you so much for watching and bye